Hey, what's going on, guys? Hopefully, everyone's having a good day. I was thinking about this the other day or over the weekend. I was in Virginia Beach, just had a lot of time to myself to think. And I think a lot of people are promoting to the wrong people. I think there's like this huge problem of producers promoting to producers to promoting to producers, promoting to producers, and everyone's just like not listening. I think there's a huge problem with trying to find your fans and people who are going to be receptive and listen to your music. So you really have to find platforms where there's people not just, it's like basically just bouncing off music to each other. So you send it to a producer, they say, oh, that's sweet. And then they send you their music. Obviously, if you want to find collaborations, connections, things like that, that's perfect. But if you're just sending things out and then you're just, and people, no one's listening. No one's really listening at the end of the day. So, and I made a video uh, about a week ago about finding your love for music again. So that's why I listen to several different genres. I listen to like a lot of classic rock. I listen to a lot of indie and other types of music. That's not my main. I really like hip hop and I really like instrumentals. That's like my main forte with uh, music, but it did start with classic rock. So uh, just find these platforms where you are going to connect with fans. There's several of them. Obviously, like Spotify, they'll they'll have like a lot of people who will listen to your stuff or like Pandora, if you can get your music on Pandora, well, they'll have fans. But like things like Instagram or like uh, Facebook, do that to cultivate like who you are as a person. But if you start just sending your stuff to like lo-fi music producers is this going to be this big circle jerk where everyone's just sending you back links and no one's really listening to the music i want to create something where everyone could just like listen to the music i almost wish there wasn't like a up like or down like or if there wasn't any views everyone just listened to a raw song without any sort of feedback of numbers that would be cool and there's just like no feedback of numbers. Everyone is just like on an even playing field. You can just like move past the songs you don't like. You just move. You don't upvote it. You don't downvote it. It's because like obviously everyone has their own taste. But wouldn't it be cool if there's like some sort of application where like I obviously there has to be some sort of standard if like the music's like really distorted or if it's like really really shitty or if it's like the kid person didn't have any interest in making it there's like blah 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 obviously like that will be like curated like on a very minimal level but it would be cool if we could just like have things that peak to our interest but weren't so validated by numbers I, i'm just kind of getting a little bit sick of uh, that whole notion because there's a lot of sweet producers that i'm finding on instagram that have like no likes and i'm like dude this guy is way better than the dude who's like completely validated getting all these comments i'm just like really confused it's like a big like popularity contest about like who I don't know. So I'm really trying to find these smaller channels and just like listen to their stuff and be like, oh, this is cool. Drop them a message. Be like, hey, you're doing a good job. And obviously like being genuine with it, like say you're doing a good job is like is different. But just just do it to people you really like, who you actually like. And I'm just sick of these producers just like sending music, sending music. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. This, I just want there to be a platform where it puts everyone in the even, play, even playing field despite numbers. Not saying people didn't earn it, but also you could buy those things too. Like you could just like buy different things. It's like almost like a pay to play system. I'm not really liking that. So if anyone has an idea for like an application uh, that could somehow change or like level the playing field for everyone just starting out, or maybe those are like the, the, the pain you have to go through to get to that level where they're at. But I feel like there's like a lot of like, uh, not undeserving, but just like a lot of people who are lower on the totem pole and they're just completely being ousted because of their numbers. And it's bullshit because like they can go pound for pound with anyone. <laughs> um, okay. So guys have a great week. I'll make one more video. So I'm probably going to, I know I always change it all the time. I always said, I'm going to make it every day. I'm going to try to do three a week two to three. No, three. I'm going to do three. Okay. Uh, so guys have a good week and I'll see you in the next video. All right. Take care. Ah, that was a weird ending.